Yeah, and then you fucking on it. <laughs> I don't know. Let me get your hands through. Totally different sound. Yep. chest. Yep. Still hit it far. That's off the fence out of Joe, dude. It's top of the fence out of Joe. That's three can. It, it hit the top and bounced back. <laughs> That's three can. Fucking people will be listening. I'll talk that shit. I can't beat it. Motherfucker. I was just thinking to myself. I was like, Dave was like, thanks, Bubba, for breaking it in for us. Yeah. I know. Hey, didn't I say that earlier? <laughs> yeah, I did say that earlier. <laughs> Good, doesn't it? Yeah. Put yeah, it down. I gave Bubba the bag, a bag, and we're in the bag, and I didn't know it. Oh. I should have just told him, no, no, in there. Back in the day, you would have. Probably. Look at that. Look at that. I hit that off my hands. I just want to feel so fucked right now. You hit that one good. Get back in and don't count. Shut up. <laughs> Look at the height they're getting on. Go and bring the fence in. Huh? <laughs> bring the fence in. I just want to hit them up there. Put it right here. Such a dick. There you go, Bubba. Fucking everything on the fucking head ain't going anywhere. Yeah, it is. That went out. Fucking terrible. There it is. All oh, good, man. You fucking smoked that one. That one. Mine went further, so I don't know why you throwing the bat. That ball takes off fast. Yeah. Feels different, doesn't it? Yeah. Look at the line drives. Yeah. See, that's what I like about it.
See, I like the way it's, the sound is working yep. now, too. See that? Right, guys we just finished up on a review on the 2024 i'm going to call it we got this bat at the end of the year last year and uh we started swinging it as you can see in the video okay let me try to explain this bat because it's different than what carlos has been putting out uh this is it right here it's got a, a, a orange barrel on it with a blue handle and that's kind of in between a royal in a navy blue it's the production model you can see it right there it's a 12 inch two-piece bat it's got the thin handle on it a lot of you guys like i love the way onyx has their handles they're pretty thin i can grab it i love it um let me tell you what i think carlos did here uh he went to a half ounce end load he, carlos used to load big mass on the end of a lot of his bats with this new line of bats that he has out right now he went to a half ounce in load. This is a 27 ounce. It's a 17 one 
on the N and 8.6 on the hands, you notice that Carlos started going up uh, a lot higher in the hand weight to make his Carlos's Onyx's half ounce end loads. This is not like a half ounce end load with all the other bats. It's the way he designs his bats with that half ounce end load. I think just me, you get better control with the handle weight in those eights. You get a little bit better control, a little bit more consistency when you're hitting line drives. <clears throat> That's me. Everybody else felt the same way too. Another thing too, what he introduced is a softer barrel in this bat. I think he wanted to attack maybe the, you know, because if you think about it in the last few years, Onyx has always had that hard barrel. Uh, a lot of the 40s, 45, 50 seniors, 55s actually like that hard barrel, the, the big mass on the end, they could compress that wall. A lot of Carlos's bats from previous have had that big mass, a dense mass on the end, a light handle weight harder barrel. I think he's taken his line a different direction, but he's keeping the harder barrel one. So he's actually, this is a line that he just opened up. Half ounce in loads is what he's going to and a softer barrel. A lot of the older seniors, including me, love the way this bat performs. I got consistency. I got distance. A few things that we saw swinging this bat. One of them was when you miss hit it, the barrel flexes and almost like it, because I'm a cutter, right? So it, it actually grabs the ball a little bit better, spins it. It's got that matte finish on it, which I think a lot of bat companies need to go to. So to that gloss finish, we got good barrel flex. Like I said, big sweet spot in it. It got striations all up and down the barrel. The way Onyx has that makes their barrel. This one, you can't see it, but it's got small striations all the way up and down it. Longevity because he did go to a half ounce end load. So you're going to get a little bit, he added a little bit more handle weight. So you got to get that pressure on that barrel. So you got to get a little more swing on the bats. This one, especially we got like 800 swings on this bat with all of us swinging it. <clears throat> Everybody loved it guys. It's going to go on that soft barrel side. Um, sweets, extra gear. I mean, there's so much shit I can say about this bat that we really did like. You get that extra gear when you hit it and it actually has that golf shot. I like hitting those golf shots because it's the way I play and the way I cut it. I'll actually hit a golf shot and come up, but you can see Bubba, Bubba will miss a ball and hit it back behind him and he'll have that spin, you know, because he's a cutter too and he, he loves, you know, cutting the ball. He'll get more distance on it. When the guys miss hit it, you can see in the video too a little bit, when the guys miss hit, they don't think it went far. But because of the flex of the barrel, softness of the barrel, they still get that extra gear and that extra distance. Guys, on that soft barrel side, it made number one. Beat out the Johnny Bailey, mainly because the way the weight distribution in this bat compared to the Johnny Bailey. Johnny Bailey's hands are too heavy. This hand, the, the weight on this bat, hands are just loaded just right, you know. So the only reason, you know, Johnny Bailey's got a soft barrel, you know, at number one. This one will be lone. Number one bat, um, soft barrel. A lot of you guys in that middle part too, and I want to separate this from the middle part. A lot of you guys on that middle part will be able to handle it for a few hundred swings. You know, if it gets too loose on you, you know, it gets too flexy on you, kind of drop it down to one of those other seniors that have the 65 minus mile an hour bat speed and let them swing it, guys. Number one on that soft barrel side, the Onyx, enough said. You can see those colors. Soft barrel. Thanks, guys. I hope you enjoyed that video. I've got a couple more here that I want you to take a look at. And if you haven't already, hit that like and subscribe button right down here below. And I also have a membership channel. It's that little join button that you have right down here. Click on it, and it actually has a small video in there that explains everything in the membership. Plus, it actually helps support what we do. Thanks, guys.